Hey, what's up? This is Omari Harabin, and today I'm going to do a side-by-side -side comparison of Flowdesk email marketing versus Squarespace email campaigns. Now, these are both email marketing tools that are uh, really catered to the creative, visual-based email person. Um, and there's a lot of overlap, but there are also some distinct differences that I want to point out. Um, and so, you know, both of these have, again, similarities that make them really appealing to creatives, bloggers, that type. Um, but then they've also got some things that depending on your business and depending on what your needs are and what you value, um, you know, depend determines which, which platform is going to be best for you. So let's kick it off with pricing. I'm going to talk about pricing. I'm going to talk about, I'm going to show you um, how to actually design emails in both of these tools. I'm going to show you the analytics and then finally uh, what you could do with the automation side of things. All right. So uh, pricing Flowdesk is really, really simple. Um, they're also new. They're in a beta phase right now, which means that you can, get unlimited emails, unlimited subscribers for $19 a month. Um, the, I think the, the regular price is, is $38 a month, but because they're in a beta, uh, you can sign up via whatever link you find, um, and you'll probably get that $19 a month uh, deal. So with Squarespace campaigns, um, there are a few more pricing options. There are actually four, four tiers. Let me see if I can pull that up for you. Um, there are four tiers and you can obviously pay annually or monthly. Um, but the way it works, okay, this is probably not the best thing to show you because this is even more confusing. Let me pull up the official um, pricing thing. Anyway, um, there are four tiers and it's broken down by the number of campaigns that you can you can send and the number of emails you can send. So that's emails per campaign. All right. So here, let me show you with the starter plan. Uh, you can send three campaigns a month. That's three emails. Uh, and then up to 500 emails per campaign a month. Now, uh, I'm not a hundred percent certain how that works. Um, other than what it says, but, that's how it works. So if you have a really small list and you only need to send one email a month, maybe a newsletter, then I think the $7 a month is definitely uh, really appealing. However, if you have a much larger uh, email list and you need to send a lot more emails per month, then um, it starts to get pricier up here with the uh, pro plan and then the max plan. All right. So even with the max plan, um, you can send unlimited campaigns. So, you know, let's say you want to send 30, one, one email a day, um, and then each email up to 250,000 emails. So basically you would go through this and figure out really what your needs are. Um, if you don't know what your needs are, then, you know, you can start out with the free free plan, which is actually three campaigns a month, up to 50,000 emails or three campaigns period up to 50,000 emails. And then, um, you start paying for one of these plans. So, uh, that's the pricing. It's probably a, a big determinant factor for most people. Um, but the other thing is what do these emails actually look like? And this is where you see a lot of overlap in terms of uh, style and the, the design functionality. Uh, it's really similar. Um, you can pick a layout uh, based off of category. So maybe you want to share a blog. Let's do a share blog and then maybe you want to do a roundup post. So let's, let's just pick this. And um, I can use this layout and customize it to create my email. And I'm going to show you the comparable uh, setup in Flowdesk. 
I just have to hang on. All right, there it goes. So I can create a new email. Come on, I'm recording live for YouTube. Don't embarrass me. Okay, so similarly, you know, based off of your goal, um, you can pick a template style. And since we're doing a roundup style post, I'm gonna pick this roundup template here. Now, the the great thing about Squarespace email campaigns is it's built into the platform. So whenever you have a form or a newsletter block, um, any type of email capture form on, on Squarespace, it's fully integrated with the email campaigns. So you don't have to embed anything. Um, with Flowdesk, you'll have to embed a form if you wanna you know, use it like that. Um, but those are two distinct features. And then with Squarespace email campaigns, you're gonna be capturing emails to different lists. Whereas with Flowdesk, you can have one list, but then different segments. All right, so I'll show you how that works in a moment. Um, but again, here's how you would edit your emails. This is Flowdesk. You can add different sections here. Um, once you hit edit text, the, the dialog opens up that lets you change your fonts, change your styles and all of that. There we go on the side, you can see, I can change the font style, I can change the layout, I can change the block style. Um, and this is all pretty pretty straightforward, easy to, to manipulate. And oops, same thing goes for uh, Squarespace email campaigns. Really easy to style. And I'm gonna show you one thing that again is a, one of the, the benefits of using this is you can add your products here um, and you can also add blog posts. So let's take a look here. I'm gonna click this plus sign and you can see I can add a product or I can add a blog post or any other kind of content. But I'm gonna select a, a blog post and then if I hit blog post, a list of my uh, recent posts are gonna show up. So I'm gonna pick one. And then boom. Like, I think this is really dope. Um, especially if, you know, you publish a couple of posts a month and you wanna send that out in an email. It's so easy to style. Another thing you can do is from a particular blog post in Squarespace, you can go to share and then you can share that as an email. So it'll take the blog post and just format it as an email and you can send that out immediately as well. Um, I find that to be uh, really, I haven't used it myself yet, but um, it's really appealing. All right, so once you've, um, you know, you've picked a plan, you've made your email, you've sent it off, uh, the next thing you wanna look at is the analytics. So I, I tested this yesterday with Flowdesk to get a sense of what the analytics look like. Um, and it's really simple. You get to see how many people opened, how many people clicked. Uh, and one thing that, that I'm curious of is what the, obviously all of the emails got delivered, but where in their e inbox did it go? Did it go to the promo tab? Did it go to the, the primary tab? Um, that's something that, uh, that I'm, I'm curious about. But yeah, as you can see, if I were to click opens or click, it would show me which emails took those actions. And that's no different than with Squarespace. Um, and show me, you know, again, how many people opened it, how many people clicked on my link, that type of thing. All right, and then the final thing is automations. Now, I'll show you Flowdesk automations first. And 
and in Flowdesk they're called workflows. And the way these workflows work is if a subscriber um, subscribes to a particular segment, then you can send them on a on a little journey, a little trip, uh, where they get a series of emails, um, and you can break it out. If maybe they didn't open an email, you know, then you might want to send another version of that email, or if they did, you can send them something else. Um, and so this is really dynamic. It's a really cool way to set up like sales sequences, um, welcome series, email courses, uh, that type of thing. Uh, with Squarespace email campaigns, let's go to create automation. Uh, the way this works is based off of a particular action. So maybe it's a new subscriber or maybe it's a new customer um, based off of one of those two things. You can send them a, a response. Um, so this is just one email uh, and you can delay it. Maybe you want to send it immediately or maybe you want to send it within a few days. But there's no um, there's no creating a sequence with Squarespace email campaigns. And I imagine that's something that they could probably add on as a few as a feature later on. Um, however, as it is right now, you know, it's simply you'll simply send uh, one specific email uh, based off of one specific action. Now, if you do sell products on Squarespace, then I think this is a, a very useful feature. Um, I currently do this with ConvertKit, which gives me a lot more flexibility. But if I wasn't, and if I was selling my, my digital products straight off of Squarespace, I would definitely use this um, because it just, just makes sense. So there you have it, um, pricing, right? Uh, Flowdesk has really simple pricing, uh, whereas Squarespace email campaigns, you kind of got to figure out what you need and then you pick what you need. Uh, creating emails, um, similar on both platforms. However, because Squarespace email campaigns is built in, you get that added benefit of being able to add products and blog posts seamlessly, seamlessly. Um, and then analytics, really simple, similar for both platforms. And then finally, when it comes to automations, uh, Flowdesk gives you a lot more flexibility in terms of creating sequences. Uh, however, Squarespace gives you the benefit of being able, again, to, to, to send emails based off of a product purchased um, or a new sub immediately for a new subscriber. So um, hopefully you found this useful if you're trying to figure out which one is for you. I think if you sell products, and being able to follow up with those customers is important to you, then Squarespace email uh, campaigns is the way to go. If you are a, a blogger, a content creator, and you wanna, you wanna be able to have like an email course or some type of uh, email sequence, then Flowdesk might be the preferable email marketing platform for you. Um, and again, I'll put a link below for both so that you can sign up, try them out, figure out what you know, what's going to be best for you. All right. Hopefully, hopefully, again, you found this useful. You can always reach out to me at sqspthemes.com or join us in our uh, Squarespace Entrepreneur Facebook group and be happy, happy to help you if, if needed. All right. Peace.